Uh, so what I've got on my screen right now is just a mechanical layout that I'm going to go through and uh, place some uh, points on. And within Autodesk or AutoCAD here, you'll see that Trimble Field Points comes up as a plugin into the application itself. So there'll be a drop down uh, menu available on the ribbon. And when I select that, you can see the Trimble Field Points application here. So it's organized from left to right, where on the very, very far left hand side there are your uh, capabilities for placing points in your drawing file. Uh, the next section over is your field point utilities, which allows you to uh, edit any of the points that you've placed in your drawing file. Uh, the next section is your annotations. This is where you can uh, start to place uh, your annotations either automatically or manually for each of your points uh, if you did not place those annotations when you initially created the point. The next section over is your reporting capability. So you have the ability within uh, field points to go ahead and create reports uh, documenting, documenting the status and location of the points that you have in your file. You can also create a deviation report uh, when you import points that have been staked out in the field. The next two tabs you have are your import and export options. Import points is where you would go to bring points in that have been staked out in the field using the robotic total station and Trimble Field Link. And then export is the tab that we'd use to export files out uh, to the field application. And you have the ability to export files to uh, both Trimble Field Link for MEP or also uh, Trimble MEP if you're using the Nomad controller on your total station. And then the last two tabs there is your setup and help menus. Uh, setup is where we're actually going to start with my settings. So I'm going to go ahead and click this button here. And I'm going to get a little dialog box that pops up here showing me my field point settings. And what this allows me to do, it's always a good tip when I come into the application to just go through and check the field point settings. And what these settings are doing is it's, it's uh, telling the program how I want to have annotations assigned to the points that I'm going to create in my drawing file. It's also going to allow me to determine what tool tips pop up when I'm working within the file. And then I have some general settings that I can do uh, to adjust my my uh, uh, attributes that I want to assign to the points. So just looking at the overall annotation uh, settings that I have here, I have the ability with each of my points to provide an annotation in two parts. I have a first part that is uh, by default set at description, and then it has a second annotation part that would be the point number. I have the ability to go through and change those if I don't like that format for displaying annotations with my points. So if I go and select on my